here we go we're uh headed into uh day number four now um a lot of fun yesterday first day on fremont street and uh so this morning go ahead on over to uh the fremont buffet uh, i guess it's the paradise buffet at uh the fremont uh hotel and casino so go have that for breakfast then we're going to uh, grab a shuttle head down to sam's town i got some free play down there and then I want to head on over to the Longhorn. Um, never been there before. Heard of a lot of interesting things. So uh, we'll check that out as well and uh, see how the day goes. Okay, guys. Uh, talk to you soon. Yeah. yeah. Okay, we're at the Fremont. Let's head inside and do up this buffet. Okay, here is the American Casino Guide uh, Fremont Buffet. And I get 50% off breakfast. So uh, let's do it. Okay, so uh, we're here at the Paradise Buffet um, for breakfast. And uh, very interested to see what sort of selection they have. Um, I know their steak dinner buffet is very good. Um, haven't had the breakfast in quite a few years. Okay, so we have some uh, donuts over here. And uh, let's just cross over to the other section. Um, there's not a huge selection of food. On the other side is a uh, omelet station. Looks like uh, we got cinnamon rolls over here. And uh, we got some waffles. Um, some crates and let's see we got bacon and sausage over here so let's just get at it and uh, let's go get an omelet okay so here's my food um, got a bunch of bacon got a uh, donut with uh, icing and there is my omelet um, let's dig in pretty much uh, cleaned up my plate here um, everything was really good including the omelet um, I paid five dollars and sixty cents not bad okay so uh, just heading down here and uh, heading towards the cow um, going to uh, grab the shuttle bus to take me over to uh, Sam's town um, this uh, George grill it's uh, triple George grill I think it's called um, I know there's some coupons for it in either the American Casino Guide or the Las Vegas Advisor. I think it's uh, buy one entree, get the second one for free. And uh, yeah, never had it before, but it's pretty much right across from uh, the downtown Grand. Okay, so I'm not really familiar with this area. Um, oh, this is that Hogs and Heifers uh, Saloon. Um, I believe it's a biker bar. Oh, cool sign. Beer this way, no beer that way. Nice. Um, so yeah, uh, lots of people have told me I should check that out at some point. I'm probably not going to get to it this trip, but in the future, absolutely. Okay, so uh, we continue on here. Hey, um, last you seen me, I had made my way over to uh, the cow and uh, I grabbed the uh, shuttle bus that takes you out here to uh, Sam's Town. And uh, now we're just taking a walk um, just near Sam's Town. And we're going to go up here to this corner, take a left, and uh, head down to the East Side Cannery and the Longhorn Casino. Um, never been to either one of these two properties, so I'm actually quite excited to uh, check them out. And then after we check those out, we will come back down here and uh, we will uh, do some free play. I still have a uh, Las Vegas Advisor coupon for uh, $10 in free play at Sam's Town. Okay, so uh, bear with me on this trip as... I mentioned before, I've never really been down in this area before. I've been told that uh, it's a short 5 to 10 minute walk in between the two casinos, so uh, that's good. And uh, we will uh, continue on this walk and we will uh, head on down to the Longhorn. Um, interesting. Oh, there you can see the sign already. Um, 
interesting to uh, check out these different casinos. Now, uh, these are more local spots. Um, from what I've been told, they have some very, very good deals. Um, the Longhorn, for example, it has a $2 blackjack. And apparently the rules are pretty good on it. So if uh, you're interested in uh, doing some blackjack, but you don't want to spend a lot of money, um, Longhorn might be the place to do it at. Um, also at the uh, Longhorn, they got all kinds of different uh, food um, food deals. So uh, you might want to check that out. And uh, he just uh, went right by me there. Um, so... We're heading down to the Longhorn, and uh, very interested to uh, check out this property. Okay, and then after we're done at the Longhorn, as I mentioned, we will uh, head on over to the uh, East Side Cannery. Um, I've been told that's actually a really nice casino. So uh, this Longhorn is really tiny. The uh, Cannery is apparently a really big casino. So. Uh, very interested to uh, check these properties both out and see how they compare. And uh, this is quite a busy road we're on. I guess this is the uh, Boulder Highway we're on, I believe. And uh, if that's incorrect, somebody can uh, correct me in the comments below. But I believe this is the uh, Boulder Highway. And we're getting pretty close to uh, the Longhorn here. Um, as you see, there's a decent-sized hotel attached to this place, um, but the actual casino size, it just looks really, really tiny. Um, I don't know. I've seen some pictures. It looks like they may only have two or three different table games in there. I know they have roulette and also the uh, well, maybe a couple blackjack tables, um, but they have a restaurant in there, and a lot of people say it's pretty good, so uh, if you're interested in uh, trying something different, maybe uh, come on down to the Longhorn and give it a shot. Okay, so uh, we continue on our uh, hike down towards the Longhorn, and uh, I'll probably... I got a coupon. There's a coupon in the Las Vegas Advisor, um, so you pay $10 and you get $20 in free play. Um, so it's not the greatest deal, but it's still, you know, I'm gonna do it, what the hell. Uh, we'll see what I come out at. Maybe I'll be able to uh, make a few bucks in the long run here. Big truck. Okay, so uh, we will uh, get up to these lights and head over to the Longhorn. We'll do the Longhorn first and then on the other side of the road is the East Side Cannery. And uh, there's a uh, good look of the big sign up the Longhorn. And yeah, it's actually a pretty nice day out today, guys. It's uh, not too hot. This trip, this uh, week, has just been fantastic for weather wise. Um, obviously, October is a really good time to come. Because uh, it's not so brutally hot out here. Okay, let's see if I can make it across. Let's hope I can make it across. Um, the uh, walk, we've got like 15 seconds here. So uh, I'm gonna maybe try and boot it across here. And we're gonna make it. Okay, so uh, now we just got across the other side of the road, and uh, we're good to go. We'll get inside here and uh, check it out. Beers, $1.50. That's not bad. Domestic and import. $1.50 beers. Um, that's actually a really good deal. Look at this. $7.99 for the uh, Porter House dinner. That's actually a really good uh, deal as well. So many good deals when you go off strip, right? And you're dealing with these uh, local casinos. Okay, so Longhorn Casino. 
Um, now, funny story, I've been told that when you sign up for the Players Club, you actually get a cookie. So, uh, we'll see if that's legitimate. I think you know, I, I was told it was a raisin cookie, an oatmeal cookie, or something like that that you get for signing up for the Players Club. That's just too awesome. Okay, barbecue platter, $12.99. Um, as I said, a lot of uh, good deals. And uh, we'll head on inside and uh, check things out. Over here at the uh, Players Club, and there's a sign on the uh, window here that says uh, they won't be back until 9.20. Look at this machine over here. Look at the prices. You can just tell we're not on the strip anymore. <laughs> wow. Crazy. I can confirm that you get a uh, cookie when signing up for the Players Club, so get down here now. Inside the East Side Cannery now, and look at this graveyard special. Steak and eggs. Looks really good. Just came across this uh, game. It's called The Love Boat. Uh, looks kind of interesting, so I'm going to sit down here and give it a go. I'll let you know if I hit anything. Okay, got my first bonus here on this game, and nice. We got Expanding Wilds, so let's see what we get on this one. Um, so far, this is a pretty cool game. I actually really like it. Um, I'm not sure if this is based on the uh, television show from years ago, but uh, it's kind of a cool game. So uh, I'll be probably sitting here for a little bit playing this. I uh, stuck $5 in the machine, and wow, that is a pretty good hit for, uh, what am I spinning at, 30 cents. So, uh, good start. Um, almost doubled my money already, so uh, that's always good. And uh, I've already ordered a beer. Okay, I got this bonus again. Which way should I go? Green, pink, green, green. And, uh... We'll see if I do as good as last time. Last time I think I got like four or five bucks on this. And uh, $1.95. Okay, we're still on this Love Boat game. I keep clicking on the uh, green heart. And double wilds again. These double wilds keep uh, coming in for me. Um, not really up a whole lot. Actually, I'm down a little bit. But I've been here for like half an hour. So it's been good times. Had a couple beers, so it's all good. Over here, uh, Eastside Cannery, they have this uh, slot showdown, so it looks like they have a slot tournament. Gonna have to uh, look into this. Okay, they have some uh, one dollar virtual blackjack here, so I'm gonna sit down. It's three to two, so uh, that's pretty good. I'm gonna sit down here and uh, play a few hands throw down a buck here on my first hand and let's see how we do okay so uh, the cards are being dealt and what do I got here a nine so uh, hopefully I can hit like a uh, face card okay that works that's a uh, 19 obviously stand on that and what does the dealer get Nice, 18. So uh, I win that hand and we uh, continue on. Okay, so I just left the East Side Cannery and now I'm making my way down to uh, Sam's Town. Um, it's really pretty cool. These uh, three casinos are all very close to each other. So it's just a short walk to each one. And uh, I definitely come back and do a coupon run over this way again. Um, Sam's Town's a really cool place. I've been here before, I gotta say twice. Um, and both times it's been excellent. They have really good drink service inside. And uh, there's a uh, $10 free play coupon. So you run $10 through the machine and then you get $10 onto uh, your card to play. So I'll be doing that over this way. We'll see how it goes. And uh, yeah, this is a uh, locals casino. I think um, it's like 15, 20 minutes off of the strip or from downtown. Um, the mountain views over this way are excellent. 
and I've always thought about how cool it would be to put a trailer over this way. They've got a KOA over here um, that's just on the other side of the uh, casino and so I think it's like five months for $2,200 for your lot fees. Um, so if I ever hit it big and I can get a new trailer, um, I think it would be awesome to spend like November, December, January, February, March out in uh, Vegas here. Um, that's a bucket list thing for sure. Now, as you see, the Century is in front of me. That's a uh, movie theater that is connected to um, Sam's Town. They also have a bowling alley in here. And uh, yeah, so it's a really cool spot to uh, check out. Um, it's a Boyd Gaming property. Um, so Boyd Gaming, they've got properties downtown like Main Street Station and uh, the Fremont and the Cal. And then uh, they also have like the Gold Coast and the Orleans. Um, so a lot of very cool properties. And uh, we're almost here, we're almost heading inside. As I mentioned before, beautiful day. Not too hot. And uh, yeah, so uh, heading inside here to Sam's Town. Um, going to do some gambling. Not sure what else I'll do. Probably do a little walk around. Give you guys the feel of the property. And yeah, so uh, let's head inside. Over here at the Firelight Buffet, and uh, I walked past this once already and was shocked at all the seniors out here. And then I seen a sign that if you earn a tier, you either get five dollars off the buffet or a free buffet. So uh, good promotion for seniors, and that's why it's so busy right now. Okay, so there's Sam's Town Live down there. That's where they hold live events. Um, here is that movie theater. I got the picture earlier from outside. And uh, over this way is an arcade. Um, so at Sam's Town, they got everything uh, you would ever imagine um, to uh, try. I would consider staying here for sure. Um, a little bit off the strip, but uh, some really good deals over this way. Okay, so we're over here. And uh, I think this is called Mystical Falls or something along those lines. Um, it's an area where it totally gives the feel of being outside in the country somewhere. And uh, you got some uh, mountains with little waterfalls and stuff. So I decided, what the heck, we'll uh, take a walk through over here and just uh, take a look at everything. So walking through here and... Uh, very cool spot i really like this um they have nightly shows actually i think the shows start at two in the afternoon i think they're like every two hours there's a show so someday i'd like to come back and uh, film that for you guys um just so happened this trip i was here during the day and uh well, that's a very cool bar um not open right now but uh yeah so uh sometimes we'll come back and the film show. So look at that. That's uh, that's really cool. Um, you get the whole tranquil uh, feeling when you're over here. And uh, I like how all the rooms look down onto this area. There's a big bear, and uh, that's cool that the animals are uh, moving. Okay, so uh, yeah, it's just I like it. I like it a lot over here with the uh, now the only problem is when you're staying over here is um, you're away from everything else right now as you've seen I walked to uh, two different casinos today so you do have a few casinos within walking distance and uh, I'm sure you could get a bus pass to hit up a lot more of the casinos down on uh, the Boulder Highway there so um, it'd be an interesting spot now we got the angry butcher over there um, they got some happy hour specials going on, so you might want to uh, look into that if you're uh, looking to stay here for a few nights or a night. Um, I've seen in the past they've run some big promotions at Sam's Town when uh, NASCAR is in town. I think they sponsor one of the races, or they used to sponsor one of the races, so uh, that'd be kind of cool. 
Okay, so you got some shops along here. Uh, that's the logo shop, I think. And uh, we'll follow this path over this way. See what else we can uh, find in this section. Um, there's a stream of water down there. Oh, look at that, little squirrel. And across this bridge over here, see if there's anything on this other side. Um, very cool spot. Oh, look at that, that's a beaver. Um, more little falls. And uh, yeah, if you haven't been over to Sandstown, definitely come on down. It's well worth a look. Um, I'm glad I did. I'm glad I did come over here and check out these casinos. I've had a lot of fun today doing this. Uh, a lot of walking, but a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, so I think I'm going to uh, wrap this video up here. And maybe we will get down to uh, playing some slots. And we will talk to you in a little bit. This looks like this could be a really cool lounge to sit in. Right now it's closed. It's called Roxy's. Um, looks like they got some uh, video poker over there. That would be neat just to sit there and uh, watch the lounge act while you're uh, playing some poker. And uh, down here is that bowling alley I had talked about. So uh, this place has it all. Over here playing turkey shoot and I'm on the Coronas. Very good drink service. Excellent. Okay, just uh, outside here at the uh, shuttle pickup spot um, at Samstown. Just waiting for the shuttle to arrive and we will be heading back downtown. Okay, so we've arrived downtown. There's the uh, shuttle bus we just got off of. And now I'm just going to take the short walk back to the Fort Weeds. Uh, my phone is pretty much dead. I'm like at 15% right now. But look at the prime rib, $8.99. Uh, that's a really good deal. Might actually have to uh, get on that before the end of this trip. Um, so yeah, excellent little adventure this morning. Um, heading on over to uh, uh, Sam's Town and the cannery and um, Longhorn. Um, so go and go upstairs, take a little bit of a break. There's Binion's Golden Nugget over that way. And uh, then we're going to go on another adventure. And we're going to try and uh, head down to uh, Jerry's Nugget. Now, I've heard mixed reviews on this place. It's in a bad area of town, that's for sure. And uh, so we will head on over there. And uh, we will check out that property a little bit. Um, interested to uh, see what it's all about. Um, it's a casino that's been around for years and years and definitely a spot that I wanted to uh, visit and uh, show on the vlog here. Okay guys, so uh, I'll be back in just a few minutes. Okay, my phone is now charged. We're ready to go. Just waiting for my Uber to pick me up and head me on over to uh, Jerry's Nougat. Okay, just got dropped over here, and yeah, it's a pretty sketchy area. Here's a strip club right across the street. $10 VIP dances. Really went through some uh, bad areas getting over here, but glad we're here. Steak and shrimp, $13.99. And let's uh, head on inside and check out this casino. Okay, so we're in the casino now, just doing some slot play. And I've hit this gossip bonus, so uh, let's see how I do. 75 credits, very nice. Now, five times, okay, five times 75, that's like uh, 375. So this bonus looks good. There's another 100 credits. Wow, so every time I've added to this uh, credits, it's at th five times, so uh, that's really outstanding. Uh, so let's see what I uh, finish up with. There's 20 more credits. Let's keep adding to this. This is uh, looking pretty good. Uh, 50 credits. So we're already over 250. 250 times five is $12.50. So a good, bo oh, nice. Okay, this is gonna be really good bonus for me. Um, spinning at only 15 cents. What did I get? $18.50 on a 15 cent bet. 
That's outstanding. Outstanding stuff. Biggest win of the trip. Okay, so we're back here and we've hit this gossip bonus again. So uh, let's give it a shot and uh, see if we can win another 1850. That would be excellent. Okay, 20 credits on the first one. And this guy's gonna make a phone call, get another 20 credits there. And certainly looks like this isn't gonna be a huge one. 75. I need to hit that five times again because that just made the bonus massive for me. Um, okay, two more phone calls, 40 more credits on top of that. And we're closing in on a buck 50 here. Um, up to two dollars now. I don't think this is going to be as big because it doesn't seem like we're hitting that bonus multiplier. 20 credits, we're up to two dollars and 25 cents. And okay, so uh, that's three dollars. That's still decent when you're spinning at 15 cents. So uh, very good. And I'll be back if I get anything else. Moved over here and playing some Texas Key before I leave. Uh, I got $10 in free play when I started. I've been sitting here for about two hours gambling and I'm still up. Um, so all free money. Um, there was a uh, coupon in the American Casino Guide for $10 in free play and I've basically just been sitting here earning tier the entire time and uh, I'm going to uh, leave with $15 in my pocket plus I've earned uh, comp money for the restaurant and a free t-shirt. Um, not a bad afternoon. Okay so with $15 extra in my pocket I'm going to be heading out here but just want to do a little walkthrough here of the uh, property and give you an idea um, what it's all about. There's a lot of slot machines and uh, they have a section of table games. Um, now I've been told that security is really tough here and uh, has actually kicked people off the property for filming. Um, we just passed the uh, bingo hall. Yep, they have a bingo hall here. And uh, so I'm not going to get too close to the table games because I don't want to give these guys any reason to uh, kick me out. Although I'm leaving here, I always like to uh, have the option to come back. So uh, we'll see how this uh, video walkthrough goes. And um, yeah, it's uh, as I said, this isn't a really sketchy area of town. Um, I heard some amazingly scary stories from the uh, uh, Uber driver on the way over and uh, he was telling me he's lived in Vegas for 51 years and just telling me about how they used to come down here and get like graveyard specials as kids and like teenagers and uh, but also hearing about some uh, really sketchy stuff that goes on in this area so uh, the casino is great like if you're just going to take an uber over here definitely do it um, take the uber here go into the casino um, you'll be fine there's nothing to worry about as far as that goes okay so uh, we see some video poker machines over this direction um, you can just get past these guys over here we got a uh, we got the sports book to the right, and uh, yeah, I'm finding a lot of these local casinos. A lot of them have the Kino. Uh, Kino seems to be very popular still with the locals. Used to see it on all kinds of different um, properties on the strip. Not so much anymore, but uh, for these local casinos, it's all about the Kino. Okay, so uh, we are reaching the far end of the casino now, and this is the area where I was playing uh, some of these uh, slot machines. Um, people talk about going to the local casinos, you got better odds of winning. I gotta agree with that. Um, I've had a really solid day. Um, haven't really won a whole lot, but I haven't lost my ass either. Okay, this is that uh, coffee shop restaurant that everyone talks about. Uh, a lot of people say this is a really good spot to eat. I have not tried it, uh, but 
a lot of people on my Twitter were um, talking about how it's really uh, some good eats in there. Okay, and we just continue on down here, and this is a this is where the uh, Uber brought me off, and so I guess I'll be grabbing another one just over here in a few minutes. Um, good casino. Um, interesting to check out different places. I'm not 100% sure if I'll be back, but not bad. Not bad at all. Okay guys, so back downtown now and walking towards the end of uh, Fremont Street here to uh, catch the deuce. I'm going to be going down and checking out Gwen Stefani. I got a really good deal on tickets for StubHub for $22 um, plus tax. And uh, that's that restaurant there. You weigh yourself if you're over 350 pounds, you get a free meal. Okay, so walking down here. It's quite busy tonight. Um, right now it's just after 6 o'clock and uh, we will be uh, heading down here. I think it's $8 to uh, take the bus and that gets you 24 hours on the bus. Um, so definitely uh, worth the money. Um, it probably right now, I checked Uber first and it was going to cost me like $15 each way. So 30 bucks, or I could pay $8 and have it for 24 hours. So uh, go and get on this bus. Talk to you soon. Down here on the strip, we're just crossing the street here and uh, get on over here. Go and check out this uh, Rockin Riley's. Um, I have a group on for $20. Um, so I probably won't have to spend a lot extra on top of that for a meal, hopefully. So we will just uh, walk around here to the side. Just looks like a happening place. I believe it's an Irish bar. Um, looks kind of cool. I heard they have a really good blue cheese burger. So I want to uh, check that out. One of my Twitter followers hit me up and uh, mentioned that to me. So we'll just uh, go in here and uh, see if we can find spot to sit and grab some eats. Over here at Planet Hollywood now, just got off the bus and I'm going to look around to see if I can find something to eat around here. Have about an hour before the concert. Okay, so it took a little bit for the uh, bartender to come over. She's real busy, but they got this black and blue burger and that's that blue cheese burger, so going to order that. Okay, so we're just waiting for my meal here and sitting at Rockin' Rallies. It's a bit of a restaurant, a bit of, bit of a bar, but it certainly looks like it's a happening place. Look at these tater tots. Oh, and the burger. Wow. Uh, I think I'm really going to enjoy this meal and uh, let's get at it. Okay, so I just took off the top of the uh, bun for you just to show you the uh, bacon and all that blue cheese on this. Hey, that burger was excellent. Just gonna finish off these taters and head on over to the concert. All right, I found my seat over here, waiting in the venue for the concert to start, and I'll be back. Okay, wonderful concert, 
and now I've come across uh, Tipsy Robot, uh, where the uh, robot actually makes the drinks for people. They order them on these uh, tablets over here, and as you can see, the robot is working on a drink right now. Um, don't think I'm going to grab one. I'm really exhausted, had a very busy day, but uh, just wanted to uh, show this. Pretty cool spot. So, just got dropped off by the Deuce back in here behind uh, the D and uh, Four Queens. So, uh, making my way back into the hotel. Um, had a very, very busy day. Hopefully, you enjoyed the vlog. Please uh, like, comment, and definitely subscribe if you've enjoyed the video. Um, I've just hit over 500 uh, YouTube uh, subscriptions. So, uh, appreciate anyone that uh, can give me some support on here. And uh, we will be back tomorrow with another vlog. Um, I guess tomorrow will be uh, day number five. And uh, I still have three full days in Vegas. So, uh, very excited to uh, continue with the trip. Today was a uh, solid day on the gambling front. I did decent. When you can break even in Vegas, I say that's a win. Okay, guys, we'll talk to you tomorrow.